Well, I tell all my friends that are in the industry that if you don't want to worry and you don't want to think about things like asset delivery and the ability to have your connectivity between your devices and your servers as fast as you can, just go with Akamai. Well, the success of games is measured by how much can you keep users engaged. And how do you keep users engaged? Well, by giving them new content all the time. So that necessarily means stuff that needs to be downloaded from, from, the, from the web. And the fastest you can do that, the greater your chances of success are. I mean, the reason I, I work in software is because at a very early age, I, I saw a video game and I thought, wow, this is, this is amazing. I want to do this. So uh, I got started in programming when I was uh, eight years old. If you're building a game, you don't want to worry about you know, server uptime. You don't want to worry about uh, you know, security incidents or the fact that you need to patch your servers. Even your engineers, that you might say, well, those, those folks need to worry about these things. They'd rather be you know, coding special effects. They'd rather be doing like, really exciting ways of engaging the user on the device. You want a player to just hit the ground running. You want a player that launches, launches our game and can start playing right away. Well, content delivery for our games is very important because that, in a nutshell, is what drives the quality of the user experience. With the fact that I wasn't around, uh, we would probably have to multiply our team by I don't know what kind of factor, or make do with a subpar solution, right? I wouldn't even want to go there and, and, and understand what we would need to do to, to replace what Akamai provides to us.